Assalamu alaikum. Today, Muslims in Canada and around the world will mark the start of Ramadan. Over the coming month, people will pray and reflect during the day, and in the evening, they'll break their day-long fast. This time calls on Muslims to honor the values at the very heart of Islam, values like compassion, peace, and service to others. And while there's no doubt that Ramadan will be different this year, I know people will still find ways to bring its true meaning to life. Muslim Canadians have always made our country a better, stronger place, and this month will be no exception. From food donations to helping seniors with grocery deliveries, organizations like the Canadian Muslim Response Network have already stepped up to help. Groups like Islamic Relief and the International Development and Relief Foundation are collecting much-needed medical supplies for our frontline workers through initiatives like Conquer COVID-19. And on that note, I want to recognize all of our essential workers who are taking care of us even while fasting. They're doing their part, and we all need to do ours. So observe Ramadan while staying home this year. Instead of having iftar with friends or at the mosque or community center, get together with them online. Keep trips for groceries to once a week or less. And if you do have to go out, stay at least two meters away from each other. This Ramadan will be different than normal, but by taking care of each other, by reaching out to family and friends, I know that it will still be full of community and hope. On behalf of our family, Sophia and I wish everyone celebrating a peaceful and blessed Ramadan. Ramadan Mubarak.